Hello and welcome to the session. I am Asha and I am going to help you solve the following question which says Evaluate root over 3 plus root over 2 raised to the power 6 minus root over 3 minus root over 2 raised to the power 6. So let us begin with the solution and we have to evaluate the value of root over 3 plus root over 2 raised to the power 6 minus root over 3 minus root over 2 raised to the power 6. So let x is equal to root 3 and y is equal to root over 2. So this expression can further be written as x plus y raised to the power 6 minus x minus y raised to the power 6. Now applying binomial theorem on both these terms, it can further be written as 6 c0 x raised to the power 6 into y raised to the power 0 plus 6c1 x raised to the power 5 into y raised to the power 1 plus 6c2 x raised to the power 4 into y raised to the power 2 plus 6c3 x raised to the power 3 y raised to the power 3 plus 6c4 x raised to the power 2 into y raised to the power 4 plus 6c5 x raised to the power 1 into y raised to the power 5 plus 6c6 x raised to the power 0 into y raised to the power 6 minus now we will expand x minus y raised to the power 6 with the help of binomial theorem so we have 6 c0 x raised to the power 6 into minus y raised to the power 0 plus 6c1 x raised to the power 5 into minus y raised to the power 1 plus 6c2 x raised to the power 4 into minus y raised to the power 2 plus 6c3 x raised to the power 3 into minus y raised to the power 3 plus 6c4 x raised to the power 2 into minus y raised to the power 4 plus 6c5 x raised to the power 1 into minus y raised to the power 5 plus 6c6 x raised to the power 0 into minus y raised to the power 6. So this is further equal to x raised to the power 6 plus 6c1 is 6 x raised to the power 5 into y plus 6c2 is 15 x raised to the power 4 into y square 6c3 is 20 so we have 20 x cube y cube plus 15 x square y raised to the power 4 plus 6 x y raised to the power 5 plus y raised to the power 6 and we have minus sign plus into minus is minus so we have minus x raised to the power 6 now on simplifying this we have minus 6 x raised to the power 5 into y and minus into minus is plus so we have plus 6 x raised to the power 5 into y now on simplifying this we get 15 x raised to the power 4 into y square and plus into minus is minus, so we have minus 15 x raised to the power 4 into y square. On simplifying this, we get minus 20 x cube y cube and minus into minus is plus, so we have plus 20 x cube y cube. Now on simplifying this, we have plus 15 x square y raised to the power 4, which is minus 15 x square y raised to the power 4. And simplifying this, we get plus 6x into y raised to the power 5 minus y raised to the power 6. Now, x raised to the power 6 cancels out with x raised to the power 6. 15x raised to the power 4 with minus 15x raised to the power 4 into y square. Then 15x square y raised to the power 4 with minus 15x square y raised to the power 4. And y raised to the power 6 with minus y raised to the power 6. So this is equal to 6 plus 6 is 12 x raised to the power 5 into y. And 20 plus 20 is 40 x cube y cube. 
and 6 x raised to the power 5. Sorry, 6 x into y raised to the power 5 plus 6 x into y raised to the power 5 is 12 x into y raised to the power 5. So now I'm substituting. x is equal to root over 3 and y is equal to root over 2. In this expression, we can further write it as 12 to root over 3 raised to the power 5 into root over 2 plus 14 into root over 3 whole cube into root over 2 whole cube plus 12 times of root over 3 into root over 2 raised to the power 5. So this is further equal to 12 into 3 into 3 into root over 6 plus 40 into 3 into 2 into root over 6 plus 12 into 2 into 2 into root over 6. So this is further equal to root over 6. Now 12 nines are 108 plus 40 into 6 is 240 plus 12 fours are 48 which is further equal to root over 3 into 396 plus on evaluating we get the answer as 396 root over 6. So this completes the session. Hope you enjoyed it. Take care and have a good day.